So guys, it's the, it's the semi-final between France and Canada and people are just crazy here. People are just crazy. One of the French players is going in, a, in the box. See the crowd? So guys, I'm with uh, Philippe right now, who is a volunteer here uh, for the world. Uh, Philippe, what do you think about the, the last game you saw between France and Canada? Oh, it's just a really great game. Two master teams that are very well organized, very strong. Did you thought that one day you will have like so much crazy people around underwater hockey for one game of underwater hockey? No, that's a big surprise actually. This whole week it has been quite uh, quiet and uh, yeah. this game with, between France and uh, Canada definitely brought the heat. When you talk about underwater hockey, what people say? Uh, there's definitely a question mark in their face. Yeah, uh, sure. In Canada, we're so we used know to that. ice hockey. We know that. But no, I get like people who watch it uh, thought it was really, really cool, very impressive. Uh, they're great athletes. Those the people are like, uh, what? Uh, okay, underwater. But uh, how do you do with a big stick uh, underwater? It must be complicated. Everybody yeah, says yeah, that, yeah. right? Everyone's a bit surprised how the game is played. But once uh, you know, once you explain it, they, it makes sense to them. Yeah. They play to the bottom of the pool with yeah. the heavy puck and uh, with a small stick. And and I think that the biggest question people have is how, how do the players stay so long on the water? Guys, I've just spotted some uh, other media here. And they're not from my company, so you know how I deal uh, with business. This is war business. Um, with the uh, other press people. Other press. Oh! No, no. Okay, I'm with other press people here. What are you guys doing here? It's, uh, it's my hood here. Yeah. Just <laughs> go away. We're doing a documentary series about uh, different competitions around the world. Okay. Unusual sports and disciplines. Okay. And uh, yeah, that's it. This is your press card. We used to be athletes, but now we're pro. Athlete press card. This is a real press card. I'm just saying. <laughs> bon, j'avoue, euh, ton geste il était pas mal. Moi, j'aurais pas fait ça. J'aurais fait autre chose. Mais c'est pas grave. C'était bien tenté. Les amis entraînent. Yeah, so everybody's crazy. Everybody's happy because uh, some teams win and some other team lose. But uh, I think that here we have a bigger problem. Who did this? To my snorkel. You, you think like what? I'm a mermaid or, or something? I have a message from this person. If you're not a coward, comment in the next episode of Puck Me, and I defy you personally. Around no, please, it's serious. It's serious. I'm going to defy you personally on the ground of the pool, underwater, in a one-one. Going to see now who is the funniest one. The last day of the worlds, and I was just going out of the office, and I just discovered. What everybody is going to drink tonight for the end of the, the world. So, Canadian beer. Here is a comparison. It's a, like an Empire State building of beers. And it seems that they're having a, a lot of stock over there. Yeah, it's going to be a long night. Guys, uh, it's the end. Now uh, you can see that uh, it's the ending ceremony. Everybody's here. Wow, so much people uh, for the end of these two amazing weeks of underwater hockey. It's so beautiful, guys. Everybody's here. The OCs with their weird wages, or I don't know what. Great Britain just here. France, Colombians in yellow, and the coach who knows better. Who knows to dance better than anyone else? Uh, who else do we have? Uh, oh yeah, oh yeah, over there. Over there we have the referees. And here is the video of my boy Francis who made it. Everybody's watching it. Oh damn. I present you guys the French girls who don't give a shit about the ceremony and are making their nails. Bravo, bravo la France. Nice. Why? What happened with the flags? Yeah, you can fix it. You can fix it, boy. Come on. Come on. Oh, boy. So, uh, we heard that there was a big party. Um, don't worry, guys. We're going to record this. Uh, I want to see you all uh, completely drunk. But just before that, uh, we're going to take a small nap because we're quite, uh, quite tired. Yeah. And so... We're going to take a nap and we'll see you there with our cameras for sure. Alex, Alex, Alex! What? What? Yeah, we are Sunday? No. You missed the party, man? No! Yes! No! 
Oh man, it was amazing, man. You missed the party, you were sleeping. I just added. Why? I think. Why? Because you, you, you did not uh, wake me up earlier. Oh, sorry, man. Sorry. You were sleeping, sorry. Okay. Um, it's the end of the world. See you later. Bye bye. At the end of Pack Me? Pack Me is finished? Yeah. Mm. I, still, I still don't know. Okay. See you later. So, guys, uh, it's over. This world's competition is over. I'm with my boy Francis, and well, I just have to say that no pleasure. I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah, it's strange to see uh, this pool uh, empty. Well, thanks again for all the compliments you made to us. Uh, I was not alone. Francis uh, made a, a fucking job of uh, of monitoring the, all of my editing of editing all my videos and supporting me because I'm not always funny. Uh, so thanks a lot, Francis. And, no problem, Alex. And, no problem. And thanks, thanks guys for all your support. And well, you are all wonderful and I hope to see you all again. Bye.